A lifetime ago, I felt the power of the Void through Dowd. All of us who were close to him could do unnatural things. Move from rooftop to rooftop in the blink of an eye. Fall on our enemies and slit their throats, like shadows sharpened to a fine edge. I made Dunwall bleed for all it had done to me, to the ones I loved. Now the Outsider has given that back, for reasons I don't understand. But it feels good. We killed so many rich bastards who thought nothing of hurting us, it felt like justice. Is the Outsider to blame for what we did? Does corruption come from the Void? Or from our own hearts? Witches and charlatans wearing necklaces of fingers and teeth. Cities sliding into chaos. Now the Eyeless peddle black magic in the streets while their leaders keep even more dangerous secrets locked away. They've got a relic that turned a boy into a god centuries ago. A knife that might be the only way to destroy that god. The outsider knows I intend to steal it. Does he know what else I intend to do? You gave me this for luck, my sweet Deirdre. I don't know if it's ever worked that way, but maybe it will this time. Hmm. I'm ready to rob the bank. It didn't kill him before. It made him into a god. Then, it can unmake him. The Void, dragging me away. I felt it a little more every day since you got me out of that club. I won't be here much longer. Let's go over the plan when you're ready. The bank is owned and managed by Dolores Michaels. I've cased the place and talked to some people and there are a few ways inside. Others have tried and failed to rob it before. They didn't have the focus we do. We're not after coin. How do you plan to get inside? There are three possible ways. The roof, the trash disposal, and the sewers. All of them might work. Once I'm in, I need to find the vault. The knife must be in there. The security in the bank will be high. What have you learned? Not much. Guards, clockwork soldiers, and a lot of locked doors that can only be opened remotely. And that's all before I'd reach the vault itself. There's an intake port on the roof that leads to the bank's ventilation system. If you find enough laudanum, most of the bank's security will be dazed before you even get inside. There was a pharmacy in the district, but it's been seized by the bank. I'll see what I can find. I know how resourceful you can be. These keys you found with the eyeless leaders will lead you to whatever holds the knife. You'll also need the bank manager's key. Deal with her how you see fit. Then I'm ready. Good. I... <coughs> do you want me to stay? No. There's nothing you can do for me here. Go get the knife. Kill the outsider. I trust you to finish this. I will, Dowd. One way or another. You've seen more than most. What we did years ago. The witches who tried to take the throne. The eyeless keeping me in that pit. But I've been to the void, Billy. All the bitterness, hatred, and fear. And the outsider gets to choose who wields his black magic and who cowers in the dark. That's something no one should decide. Do you really think he's to blame for all of that? For what we all did? 
The outsider gave me his mark, knowing what I could do with that kind of power. For years, I carved up Dunwall from the inside until it fell apart. The world doesn't need more men like me. I heard word of a thief who nearly made it inside through the sewers, but couldn't get past the gate. Only the maintenance workers can open it. I had a street kid knock some bricks out of a tunnel wall down there. If I'm lucky, there'll be someone there to fix it. It could be the quickest way in, though not the most pleasant. There's a security entrance on the roof, but getting up there will be a challenge. It would be. For your average burglar. If I can unlock the grate, then the path through the trash disposal would be simple. You could pay the custodian a visit. See if he'll give you the key. The Eyeless murdered Cienfuegos, the pharmacist, for some reason. There might still be a way to get enough laudanum. See if he left behind anything you can use. The guards use authorization codes over a public announcement system to issue orders, but it changes every shift. There's no way to find them out without going in. Those codes will be useful to reach the most sensitive parts of the bank. I know you'll be able to find them one way or another. I bribed someone to slip me schematics for the vault mechanism. It's some kind of fancy elevator. A Jindosh creation, as always. A control room can move the vault into two places. The basement where they keep the safety deposit boxes, and the manager's office. Jindosh may have been a genius, but his inventions are more fragile than they look. There's an old sewer under the bank. I wonder what the former grand inventor would think if he knew his precious vault had crashed down into it. Dolores Michaels, cultist and creditor. The wealthiest people in Karnaka trust her with their fortunes. If word gets out that someone broke into her vault, she'll be ruined. How am I supposed to get to the void? You've always been good at uncovering secrets. The Eyeless have to know a way. Once you have the knife, finding that out will be your next move. <laughs> so what's it like? The Void, I mean. It feels as if you've cried for help and no one answered. The bank will be difficult, but I know you've walked out of worse. After hours, it should just be night guards, a handful of accountants, and Dolores Michaels herself. When you have the knife, find out where the Eyeless make their headquarters. That will bring you one step closer to the Outsider's throat. I won't see what the world becomes when the Outsider dies. It's strange to see you change like this, but I know you're still my Billy, and I trust you. When you have the knife, you have to find a way to reach the void. I'm sure the Eyeless know. When you find the Outsider in the void, end him. The world will be better off without that black-eyed bastard giving out his magic to the lucky few. They say cursed spirits wander the void. I've wandered this world long enough. Leave me, Billy. I can't do anything for you. Go. You know the knife is in the bank vault. I've never seen doubt so weak. I might never see him again.
if she can help. Please, just go away. You bet will be just the thing. I don't feel like talking. Not doing that again anytime soon. Maybe I should have it looked at. I don't think it's supposed to fester like that. And a little pus is all right, but this. Mm. Yeah. Uh, keep watching. I just need to figure out. Hurry up! The longer we stay here, the better our odds are of getting caught. Think you can crack this lock any faster? Be my guest. Oh, sorry, Sal. I know you've got it under control. I'm just worried about those guards we saw earlier. No amount of coin is worth going to Balmet Prison. Let's get in and get out fast, okay? That's the plan. Please, just go away.
Why the outsider? The bank sent you, didn't they? Well, sorry to disappoint you, but I've got nothing left. You can't bleed whale oil from a bone. Tell your trustees that! I'm not from the bank. I saw that your father's pharmacy closed. Do you know where else I can find laudanum? Yes. The auction house. My father used to distill laudanum by hand from a secret family recipe. Poppy tincture, he called it. Better than factory made. But the bank's selling that along with all of his other worldly possessions. They took everything we had. I'm sorry for your loss. The newspaper says Ivan Jacoby murdered him. His body was completely drained of blood when the Grand Guard found him. I've no idea why anyone would want to hurt Father. Anyway, the auction's today. You better hurry. And wear a hat or something. The guards won't let you in looking like... that. Father's belongings will be sold at auction today. That crooked bank took everything we had. You should hurry if you want Father's poppy tincture. Someone else might bid on it. The guards won't let you into the auction looking like that. Maybe spruce yourself up a bit. Greetings. I provide only the finest service with absolute discretion. Hmm. Someone looks armed and dangerous. I'm certain you'll be satisfied with your purchase. An excellent choice. was Jacoby hiding here? Silver graphs? Letters? Could be anything. <sighs> careless. Stupid and careless. Jacoby deserved to get caught. We're all in danger now, thanks to him.
The rich are always the worst thieves. The Cienfuegos lot looks promising. That wild painting, striking. Mother would love it. I can't go in there looking like this. I need to find another face. What a day. The dinner service was late. The bath water was too warm. Well, I know what I'm bidding on. When is this auction going to resume anyway? today comes from the Cienfuegos Pharmacy. That's right, the entire store inventory. You'll get everything from them, uh, syringes to a uh, poppy tincture with plenty of useful items in between. And, ladies and gentlemen, look at this magnificent original painting signed by Eleuterio Cienfuegos himself. Who knew that our late lamented pharmacist had so many talents? Let's get started. A reminder that all bids are final. If you leave during the auction, your bid is forfeit. Clear? Good. I have a bid of 280 over there. Do I hear more? 280 going once. 280 going twice. 300. I have 300. Who bids 320? 300 going once. 320. 320 for an entire estate. Lock, stock, and poppy oil. 340 over there. I have 340. That's more like it. Do I 360. I have 360 over there. How about 380? 380? Three. I have 380. How about an even 400? Do I hear 400? Aha! 400 over there. You know a bargain when you see it. 400 for this entire estate lot. Who bids for- I want it! 420? Yes. I see you, sir. 420 to the man in red. Am I bid 450? For me. Oh, me. I want it. 440. That's more like it. 440 for the lady in the blue hat. Oh! I think we have Lady Cottington in the audience. I didn't recognize you with the hat. It's an honor, milady. 440 going once. 440 going twice. 460! 460 for an entire pharmacy stock? Come on, ladies and gents. Who bids 480? 460 going once. 460 going twice. Sold for 460 coins. Good. The poppy tincture is mine. I'm sure I can make up the loss at the bank. Congratulations. You've won this fine lot of items from Cienfuegos Pharmacy. Please retrieve your new belongings promptly after the auction. And that's it for bidding today, ladies and gents. But never fear, we'll be back on the block next week with more treasures to tempt the tasteful eye. You feel a special kind of loneliness when the world treats you like filth. Why do I pay for a house full of 
when they don't do anything. My slippers weren't in their usual spot. What next? Karnaka Gazette! Get your gazette for the news of the day! This shirt reeks. I gotta get a spoon. Blood flies never stay caged for long. Serves her right. We should gather. Why? Why do I have goosebumps all of a sudden? Shalyan left Karnaka. That's what the Gazette said. They said he left to take the waters at some Tivian spa and cancelled all his concerts. Uh, I sold half of Grandma Felicia's jewelry to pay for those tickets. It was going to be my first Shalyan concert. Oh, I know it's not the same. But the Tivian Songbird Society is honoring his memory with a concert in Corobron Plaza next week. Want to go? Soon. The world is a dark, empty pit without Shanyun. Is this what the void is like? you with something? Yes, a drink. Let me in. The Spectre is a private club. Are you a member? Right here. See? Uh, Yelena's work is getting sloppy. Nevertheless, you may enter. Welcome, 
Would you care for something to drink? We have the relic. That's all that matters. Come so far. They say it's secure. It all started with drowning that baker's son in the pond. That showed them I'm serious. <laughs> jacket. I'm not drunk enough to have a conversation. Good evening, Michael's Deposit and Loan. I'm here to make a withdrawal. should just work a double shift so I don't have to listen to him tell me about how good it was at the Duke's farm. You can tell he's no good just by looking at his shoes.
Good. There's someone here for maintenance. The wrench to get the hatches open should be nearby. This should be able to open the hatches. should get extra rations. We work harder, and we come from better families. I should think that's just obvious. I bet they never expected anyone to slip through there.
day yet. Gotta be soon. I'm in. Easy. Now for the difficult part. I need to stay quiet. They could still wake up if I make too much noise. Cienfuegos was obsessed, and it got him killed. Pretty sure I took it with me. should be able to open some doors from here.
frail to time being, while each day cuts deeper into their throats. Some want revenge, others just want peace. be the vault. It's some kind of fancy elevator. A control room can move the vault into two places. I need to find a way to move that thing, one way or another.
incredible day. Does the void really look like that? This is what I needed. Wake up. I need you to let me in. Huh? Outsider's eyes. If Pena caught me sleeping on the job, he'd make me run the shock board. <clears throat> May I have the code, please? It's B15D. Now let me in. Okay, okay. Come on in. And uh, I'd appreciate it if you didn't tell Chief Pena about my tension lapse.
I hate these things. Why are they smiling? Just testing the mechanism. That wasn't scheduled. Nobody tells me anything. All right. Starting a commercial venture? Michaels and Associates can help. I'm here to steal all your secrets, Dolores. Looks familiar, but I've never seen anything like it. I need that. More hopeless art. Dolores Michaels likes to keep all her secrets where she can see them. Good. I have the vault key. What else is she hiding? They know a way into the void. Cienfuegos sent Isla's documents to the Royal Conservatory. I need to find out what he knew. The Conservatory is my next step. A mining camp in the mountain? But it's not right. It's been changed by the void. It doesn't exist. Or shouldn't. Two locks. This has to be the one.
You and I were both abandoned to uncertain futures on dangerous streets and taken in by murderers. Dowd spared your life all those years ago, but I was taught a lesson that you still haven't learned. Someone will stay with you, even in the void. Give it to me. I don't have time for this. Time repeats in the same unending patterns. 4,000 years ago, this knife cut my name away. Forgotten forever. You know what it's like to lose one name and live with another. We are all made by the things that are taken from us. I've seen the people you've twisted with your poisonous magic. You know what I want. You know I'm coming for you. I know more than most. I know that time is bleeding into itself around you. I know that you have felt it, and you are searching for the places where the world has broken against the void. I know that doubt is dead where you left him on your ruined ship, and you will carry that knife with you to face me at the black center of all things. Why are you doing this? Why are you talking to me now? I'm here because you are different. The void has found you through the cracks in your broken life. And when you cut me out of it, what will remain? What will you leave behind when you walk away? What does the Outsider want from me? Doubt. Is he really gone? I have the knife. I need to get back to the Dreadful Will.
If I can find the maintenance lever, I could take the entire vault off the track. Could be a way to get to it. A loud way. This could work. They covered my mark into the old bones bleached by the sun. They covered my mark into their skin. They were in true hunger from the void. Hmm. I could get that vault moving with a little maintenance. will be a mess when they find out what I've done. But until then, nothing but quiet. servants are for.
I was lunched and I'm a filthy blood fly. And that's all I'm gonna say about it.